Hi, this is Brian. Welcome back to another Optimize Plus One. The other day I headed to Google to look up the meaning of the phrase force multiplier. Short story, when we initially launched our Optimize Coach certification program, I said that I believed our program could be a catalytic force multiplier in helping people optimize their lives so we can change the world together. After the first couple of months working with our first class of coaches, I am more certain of that catalytic power than ever before. Enter a quick Google search on force multiplier so I can wrap my brain around the precise definition of that powerful phrase. The best and first answer came from personalmba.com. Thanks, guys. And thanks, Google, for connecting us. Here's how they put it. I quote, force multipliers are tools that help you amplify your effort to produce more output. A hammer is a force multiplier. Investing in force multipliers means that you'll get more done with the same amount of effort, end quote. Brilliant, huh? Now, would you rather hammer a nail in with your hand or with a hammer? Same basic swinging motion of effort, but the hammer delivers a lot more output with the same amount of effort, while obviously saving your hand from the ouch hammer for the win. Now, while taking a quick gander at other definitions and examples of force multipliers, I stumbled upon a brilliant blog post about some wisdom from retired four-star general and former Secretary of State, Colin Powell. Here's how Powell puts it. Again, I quote, in the military, we are always looking for ways to leverage up our forces, Having greater communications and command and control over your forces than your enemy has over his is a force multiplier. Having greater logistics capability than the enemy is a force multiplier. Having better trained commanders is a force multiplier. He continues by saying, perpetual optimism, believing in yourself, believing in your purpose, believing you will prevail and demonstrating passion and confidence is a force multiplier. If you believe and have prepared your followers, the followers will believe, end quote. Perpetual optimism. Isn't that a beautiful phrase? Well, it might just be our most powerful force multiplier. Tomorrow, we'll talk about a little distinction to that wisdom, but today, I'd like to do a quick check-in. How's your belief in yourself and your belief in your purpose and your belief that you will prevail? Let's remember that our passion and confidence are force multipliers. Our followers, be they our kids or our colleagues or our staff or ourselves, are always watching and taking our lead. So let's lead wisely. Let's multiply our power via perpetual optimism. How can you boost your optimism just a little more today?